Welcome back guys to a new video. Now today's video is going to be about how you can spawn in all the new Scorched Earth Dinos using the console commands. Very simple and very easy. Very similar to the video I did about four months ago when the console commands first came out. So if you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to smash the like button as always guys and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And also I hope you did enjoy the video I did earlier which was you know showing you guys all the new Scorched Earth Dinos and them tamed and everything. So I'm going to be showing you how to tame them as well in this video. So as you turn around, we have got a little example, which is the Manticore, which I did spawn in and I did tame. Now, you have to wait a little bit with them for some reason when they go up in the air, um, and then they'll just come back down. They don't even follow you, but it does look epic from afar. I don't know why it just looks so cool, but I'm going to be teaching you guys in this video about how you can actually t uh, summon anything you want in and also tame one. Now, I'm going to be leaving a link in the description down below to all the different, um, to literally everything you need to, like, all the what you need to type in with the name but obviously this video is going to explain it but the website is very simple and very easy so I'll be leaving the link to that in the description down below too so let's say we want to spawn in a wyvern so we, we want to spawn in one of them so and you know you need to know which this is the most like confusing one of the whole video because they they the wyverns are a little bit different to the normal dinos because you have to add in extra words because obviously you know what you, you might want to poison one you might want to fire one you might want an electric one so we'll start with that so the first thing you type is obviously summon, and then you put space, you don't put anything after that, and then this is the part where you decide which dino you want. So let's say we want a a poison wyvern. So all we put is we put wyvern straight away after that. Um, I usually stick to capitals, you don't have to, but I, I think you might for the BP and the C, but I stick to them anyway. You might not have to, but just to say safe, then you put character. And um, obviously, you know, with the capital C, I always do it just to make sure because that's what, that's what everyone usually does. Character. Then we go underscore again. And then you need to um, you need to put BP, but then you don't put the usual thing, which is obviously C. You need to choose which type of, you know, uh, which type of, um, uh, like, wyvern that you want. So obviously, I think we'll go with poison. So we'll go with that first. So we'll go with poison. And um, then after you've put which type of wyvern you want, you need to put underscore again, and then you finish it off, close it off with C. So once you've done that, you can press admin command, and then there you go, it has spawned in a poison wyvern, which now you guys are obviously going to want to tame it. So obviously you can tame it legitly, but in this video I'm just going to be showing you guys how to do an easily, easy tame and be able to ride it straight away. You click, you type in force tame, as you can see there. And then you click admin command. And once you've done that, you have your very own poison wyvern. It looks pretty damn cool. And we'll show you what it does. Um, and there we go. So that it shoots out poison. I think I've just shot the manticore. I didn't mean to do that. I wonder if it can knock it out. I wonder if it knocks it out. Oh, he's been shot. I, I don't know if it. I don't know if it will actually do anything, but we can give it a go. I doubt it, but yeah, the poison ones are pretty awesome, so I, I I do love them a lot. And there's the manticore there. Obviously, all you have to do for the manticore is very simple as well, very similar to that. I just want to quickly see the poison. Oh, look how cool the poison wyvern looks! Looks absolutely insane. So let's say you know you don't want a wyvern and you just want to keep it simple. Let's say let's go for the one of the golems, one of the elementals. You literally just put summon again. Really simple and really easy. You guys summon and then space and let's say we want to go for um, which one should we go for this go for last time I did a rock golem so I don't know what the difference is between the rubble and rock golem so we'll do the rubble golem this time and uh, see what this one looks like so you put the name of it which is obviously um, rubber golem and I'll be as I said I'll be leaving the, uh, the website the link in the description down below so then you can find out all the different names anything you would want so rubber rubber, rubber golem and then you go to underscore this these ones are so much more simple than the wyvern one uh, wyvern ones because um, obviously you know you literally just put character and then you put underscore after that and then BP underscore C so it's literally so simple because there's obviously only one version of this character so then we will obviously click admin command and maybe maybe that one isn't one in the in the game yet. I don't know this okay let's just go for a rock rock golem because I it says there's one rubber golem but I don't know unless it spawned in the little rock let's see because oh no it has it has it has done it oh there it is it's, uh, what what's this one is it exactly the same oh it's a little bit smaller so it's a little bit smaller than the rock golem. Uh, but obviously, you know, we'll, um, we'll uh, force tame it. So the, obviously, as you can see, I thought this one was going to be some different type of, you know, material or something. I know, like, an, I know rubble would probably be pretty similar, just exactly the same to rock. But, you know, this is a, very, a bit of a smaller version of the... Um, 
Oh, okay. Oh, I've spawned in two. We're going to have a little battle. Let's have a little battle against it. We, let's see if we can actually... Um, we, we seem to be losing a bit of health, but where's our poison wither? Is it actually going to do some damage to it? Um, it's, it's, it's doing quite a lot of damage, I think. I don't even know. But um, I, I'm hoping we're winning. Let's throw a rock at it. We're about, oh, we're, we're tired. We're tired. Oh, it's coming back for us. It's coming back for us. So um, we'll, let, we'll let it have its, its little fight. Maybe we should just force tame it to cause to stop causing any, you know, like, stuff. So let's just force tame it. And there we go. We saw it there. So um, let's do one more thing to show to you guys. So let's maybe do a Mantis. So I know that's one of the most popular ones. So very simple, very easy. Again, summon. Then once you put summon, that's all you need to put, guys. Space. And then the name of it, which is the Mantis. And then once you've typed Mantis, and then you go to underscore. Very easy, guys. Then caps lock for C, character. And once we've typed that in, you do underscore again. And then after this, underscore C. And once you've done that, it will spawn in your dino as shown before. And we've got our Mantis here, which they are so cool. I think they're a passive tame, actually. I think I just saw it look like a passive tame. So if it is, I reckon they'd be a pretty hard tame. Um, I'm hoping they're, I'm hoping you can tame them both ways, but I'm not too sure. So force tame, and then bang, and there we go. We have got ourselves our Mantis, which I love these so much because you can do the little jumpy thing. I love... Oh, whoa, we actually went really far that time, so... It's going to keep using the Mantis quite a lot. I'm loving it. Let's, let's attack this moth here and see, let's see if, it, if it does this little pooey thing on us. Oh, that was a good hit. Yep, it, it did a little pooey thing. Um, it didn't do very... I mean, it's done a little bit of damage to us, but compared to what we've just done there, it is pretty crazy. So thank you for watching this video, guys. I hope you did enjoy. I hope you do know now how to, you know, get every, summon anything you want, all the dinos. As I said, I'll be leaving the a link in the description down below to where you can find out all, all, like, the dino names when you can summon them in yourself. Make sure to smash the like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys.